Eric Alterman Vertical Line The Nation. Baby Policy. Subscribe Donate Store Programs. Home Blogs Columnist Current Issue Magazine Archive Multimedia Ebooks. Nation Builders Students. Help. Politics. World. Books and Arts. Economy. Environment. Activism. Society. Lived History. America's Afghan Victims. Movement Social Justice. Arts and Entertainment Books and Ideas. Business Economics Labor. Environmental Issues Science. U.S. politics government political figures cities states. Sports education gender and sexuality health law media race and religion from the archive. Arab awakening foreign policy war and peace world leaders global organizations regions and countries. Eric Alterman vertical line the nation. Tim Decker Staffer, there is no neutral in the climate fight. Leslie Savan, will the right demonize Sherlane McCrae. Tom Tomorrow, the Tea Party freedom fighters. Eric Alterman. Author bios. Click for more. Eric Alterman. Columnist. Eric Alterman is a distinguished professor of English, Brooklyn College, City University of New York, and professor of journalism at the CUNY Graduate School of Journalism. He is also the liberal media columnist for The Nation and a fellow of the Nation Institute, a senior fellow at the Center for American Progress in Washington, D.C., where he writes and edits the Think Again column a senior fellow since 1985 at the World Policy Institute. Alterman is also a regular columnist for Moment magazine and a regular contributor to the Daily Beast. He is the author of seven books, including the national bestsellers, What Liberal Media? The Truth About Bias and the News 2003, 2004 and the book on Bush, How George W. M. Bias Leads America 2004. The others include, When Presidents Lie. A History of Official Deception and Its Consequences, 2004, 2005 His Sound and Fury, The Making of the Punditocracy 1992, 2000 Which won the 1992 George Orwell Award, It Ain't No Sin to Be Glad You're Alive, The Promise of Bruce Springsteen 1999, 2001 Which won the 1999 Stephen Crane Literary Award and Who Speaks for America, Why Democracy Matters in Foreign Policy, 1998 his most recent book is Why We're Liberals, a handbook for restoring America's most important ideals 2008-2009. Termed the most honest and incisive media critic writing today in the National Catholic Reporter, and author of the smartest and funniest political journal out there, in the San Francisco Chronicle, Alterman is frequent lecturer and contributor to numerous publications in the U.S., Europe and Latin America. In recent years, he has also been a columnist for MSNBC.com, Worth, Rolling Stone, Mother Jones, and the Sunday Express London a History Consultant to HBO Films and a Senior Fellow at Media Matters for America. The former adjunct professor of journalism at NYU and Columbia, Alterman received his B.A. in History and Government from Cornell, his M.A. in International Relations from Yale, and his Ph.D. in U.S. History from Stanford. He lives with his family in Manhattan. Articles News and Features Marshall Berman, All That Is Solid Melts Journalists and Journalism Liberals honor a great public intellectual while the editor of commentary compares him to a Nazi. Eric Alterman Frank Brunier, The Plutocrats Pundit Journalists and Journalism All too often, the most prestigious perch in journalism the New York Times opus ed page is given to those who flatter the powerful. Eric Alterman Bill D. Blaze C.O. and the Rebirth of Economic Liberalism Political Figures, Cities The leading candidate for New York City Mayor shows the way forward for Democrats. Eric Alterman The Washington Post's Dubious Salvation Corporate Media and Consolidation, Journalists and Journalism, Media As the old journalism dies, what does the Bezos era portend? Eric Alterman The MSM and the Snowden Affair, Where True Loyalty Lies Journalists and Journalism, Media Increased security after 9 to 11, the Constitution. Why, to Beltway reporters, Glenn Greenwald is no Bob Woodward. Eric Alterman. The outside of genocide foreign policy, regions and countries. The reputations of Reagan era officials who enabled the Guatemalan genocide have not been tarnished. Eric Alterman. Ron for Yale, doomsayer journalists and journalism, media. Reports of President Obama's demise turn out to be greatly exaggerated. Eric Alterman. Rupert Murdoch. Journalism's Jack the Reaper. Corporate Media and Consolidation.